Hello, everybody. So, uh, done my due diligence. As you can see, I was able to kill one of them. I'll just take that real quick. I've come back for a vengeance since last episode. I have trained hard. I don't think they stand a chance this time. Let's see, we'll start with a that. A topple. And then a s see if tranquilizer works. Shows him. Hopefully he's asleep. Can we focus? Focus the efforts. And we can't move. There we go. There we go. Need to get a chain attack up. Come on. It's almost a chain attack time. Finish him. One left. No! We need to save her. Finish this off. Coming with that topple. Boom. That two shotter. Didn't stand a chance. Give Charlotte some heals. No, she's down. Kind of stuck here. There we go. What is this thing doing, dancing over here? Stuck on the uh, the ramp. That's all right. Got the Monado. Boom. Dead. Let's keep on going like this, guys. Now that is what I call a good revenge story. Saint Rod. <laughs> All right. Worker. Thanks, I thought I was a goner there. The things could have turned out really nasty if you hadn't come. I'm off to fix the transporter now. I'll see you around. Uh, little did you know, I showed up a few times. Trying to find a... Uh, when I could just cheese it, turns out it's level 33, so you can beat them three levels under if they're in a horde of three or four. And that is the extent of my discussions with the Homs that accompanied Melia here. I still cannot believe it. How could a Telethia have grown to such power? And what is your conclusion, Seer? that the Telethia were able to gain such power due to the high levels of ether in the region. In other words, our ether protection is weakening. And so it begins. The resurrection of the Bionis. What of the Monado? Excuse me? I cannot see. My sight is hindered. However... Speak, Seer. It is not certain that the Monado will bring about our destruction. While my sight is hindered, I have seen a sliver of light. Is your majesty not aware of this light as well? Are you referring to Melia? And the young man, Shulk. Could it be that the boy is trustworthy after all? <gasps> no way. Kalyan, we are on the cusp of a significant moment. The investiture ceremony must take place as soon as possible. Your Majesty, since the ministries are already in agreement, we may be able to bypass some of the formalities. Indeed. But she must still earn the blessing of the people. Might I suggest the trial of the tomb? First consort, such a ritual has not been conducted for generations. Yeah, don't you think that's a little fishy? We not had a need for it until now. And I feel she is more than equal to the challenge. Mother, the tomb is dangerous. 
Our records show that many potential successors lost their lives performing the ritual. That child fought and beat the Telethia. It is my belief that she is more than strong enough. Besides, if it was revealed that she avoided such a responsibility, her reputation among the people would be irreparably damaged. I must protest. Uh, the first consort is right. There is much risk, but the rewards are greater. It would seal the people's love for her. Summon Melia. Her thoughts must be heard. Well... I accept. If I am to lead the High Entia despite my mixed heritage, if I am to succeed the throne, then I accept what must be done. I expect nothing less of my successor. The path to greatness is fraught with danger. This shall be your statement to Bionis. Yes, your majesty. You are not fit to be Empress. Not now, not ever. Hmm. You heard that too, huh? Kinda weird, if you ask me. Oh, looks like we got them out of a scrape. Yeah, after like two Shark. hours of grinding. Ricky tired. <sighs> Ricky sleeping castle now. I'm with you, Good Ricky. Idea. Let's head back to the capital. The sooner the better. <clears throat> yeah, dude. Uh, His Majesty speaks. He always speaks in such a way like he's really rushing it out. It's like, uh, I really don't want to be here. Oh, dude. Can we just fast travel there? Doom, 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 boom. Oh, yeah, duh. We... Uh, excuse me? Excuse me, what? Yeah, that's where we need to go, huh? I thought they would have one in the building. Ah. Oh man, I'm tired. Head on up. This place is too big. You'd expect to see like tons of people walking around here, but you see like five in total. Okay, maybe not in total, but you know what I mean. Oh, I'm gonna have to check out that shop over there later. I was running around here earlier looking for a shop to upgrade my gear. Went back to uh, the Nippon Village and upgraded there. Alright. Teleport away! Everyone's gathered outside. How come we didn't get invited? It looks like some kind of ceremony. Okay. Cool, invisible My TV loyal things. My and beloved subjects. Saurian Antiqua speaks. I have been your emperor for little more than 20 years. But today I stand before you in celebration. So that's the High Entia Emperor, Saurian Antiqua. I will remain your emperor for years to come. But now is the time to announce my successor. May I introduce your crown princess. And there's the lady herself. 
Melia Antiqua. It's... it's her. She's... she's a princess. Took you long enough. Right. <sighs> her silver spoon accent was a clue. But royalty? My daughter, Melia Antiqua, will depart immediately <clears throat> to face the tomb. She will seek the approval of our ancestors and become your crown princess. That mask is creepy. Lots of silence. Oh. <gasps> I see. You better rush on over there. We have a princess and, more importantly, our friend to go after. The people are fickle. No mask can hide that girl's contaminated blood. Excuse consort, me? All the pieces are in place. Say the word and the captive Homs shall be no more. The savage who discovers fire remains a savage. Disappointed or not, his highness will turn a blind eye to their fate. And their removal will deprive Melia of some powerful allies. As you say. Mother? We continue to endure the contamination of our bloodline by perpetuating this wretched tradition of a High Entia First Consort and a Hom Second Consort. For how long must I suffer these Homs? You are a racist. Do your duty, Tyrea. As you wish. That mask. Did you not hear everything that just, <laughs> that just went on? You hear all of that? She's like, Melia. I'm gonna kill them and everything. That mask. Hmm. I don't doubt that was Melia. But why the mask? I don't know. But she's different from the other Hyentia. How do you mean? Melly not like other bird people. Melly like hom hom friends. You might be right. But there are things at play here we can't understand. Wait a minute! Oi! You'll give a homs a heart attack shouting like that! We've got no time to lose. Melia needs our help. Again? <laughs> you had another vision, didn't you? What did yeah, you see? earlier. Out with it already! Dun, 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 dun. Excuse bum, 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 bum. We ordered room service an hour ago. Oh, Dunban. Oh. Ah, why is it just three of us, though? Oh, they're only 34, dude. Weak. Enjoy that. Can we? Dude, I'm getting beat the heck up. Oh, that's unfortunate. I like how they just ran off. They're like, our job is done. Okay. Well, at least they're waiting for us. Ah, oh, dude, I am so screwed. Doing 
Well, as you can see, I had to switch characters and whatnot. It, it, it took me like eight times. Eight long battles. But I finally did it without having to go back and level up, dude. This is ridiculous. I can't believe I did that. I, I really can't. <laughs> Shulk. Ah, oh, dude, that was ridiculous. Let's see, it's dude's forty-three. I spent like These are half inquisitors. an hour on that battle. What is this? More of them. Wait, this is His Highness Callion, brother to Her Highness Melia. Melia's brother. Do not concern yourself, your highness. The matter appears to have been resolved. Seer Alvis? I foresaw the danger. I rushed here, but seem to have missed the fun. They do not look like mere thieves. I am presuming they are inquisitors of the Bionite Order. A group of assassins long devoted to the Imperial family. Ridiculous. The Bionite Order are a mere... Myth. The Order existed before records began. I, like many others, believed they had long since died out. Yet here they are before us. Is Father aware of this? I suspect he knows very little. He may not even be aware of their existence. They live amongst the shadows, never revealing their true faces. But that does not explain why they would attack these people. Uh, dude, you were right there. When you heard your mom talking. Wait. Could that yeah. have been... Duh. No. There's no way. Callion. Melia is in danger. She'll be killed as an altar if we don't find her soon. Killed? How can you be so sure? Shulk and I share the same gift. Another seer? Which would mean that you can see the future? Yep. That's why we have to find her. Now. Well, with how long it took me to actually complete that battle, because I was just too stubborn to go back to grinding. But I did it, dude. I, I can't believe I did it. Your Highness. As agreed, you will face the ritual alone. I thank you for escorting me. We wish you a safe return. As history has proven, all those who stake claim to the throne without merit will spend eternity as how are you how are you still here I, I reported you to HR I must prove my worth as the next ruler and I am no less prepared to sacrifice my life than those that have fallen before me most wise your highness how can you see out that mask watch your back your highness oh yeah watch out for them evil kisses that she blows at people they sting like acid. Unacceptable. Those who enter the tomb must do so alone. Uh. Her life or death is in the hands of fate. Those not worthy of the throne are exactly that. You can't seriously think that. This is your sister. This is Melia. Easy, Ryan. But Dumban! This ritual holds a special significance. It is wrong for us to interfere. I don't like it. Even but if am it I is right rigged? in saying that the rules of this ritual affect only Hyentia? And if some strange Homs happened to get involved, it wouldn't cause a problem. Or is there some rule that prohibits Homs from entering the tomb? No, I suppose not. Then look at it this way. I don't need to know how big a deal this ritual is to your people. What I do know is that your sister's life is at stake. Cut us a break, and we'll save her. 
Nice loophole, Who man. Are you? My name is Dunban. I'm sort of the protector of this Mekon bashing band of Homs. Dunban. I know you. At the Battle of Sword Valley, you held back an entire wave of Mekon with the Monado. Yep. You know a lot about a battle you never showed up to. My apologies. We do not concern ourselves with the wars of others, be it against the Mekon or otherwise. I was only joking. You had your reasons. I can see that with all these defense systems, you don't really need to fight. Then it is decided. You can reach the tomb by transporter from the center gate. Her Highness has already entered. Shulk, you should hurry. You have a very thick accent every single time you say Shulk's name. Shulk. It's very kind of soothing in a way. Main menu. Oh, that's... Yeah, I'll switch my characters later. Anyways, um... Oh, dude, did I level up from that? Wrong button. Yeah, I leveled up from that. Anyways, so this is where I'm going to end this off. Because that battle was freaking ridiculous. <laughs> uh, I've learned my lesson with these games. The Xenoblade series, I mean. And leveling... Uh, cause they, they basically use it as a paywall, but aside from money, it's grinding. Uh, if you're not a certain level, you just cannot progress the story, period. So, anyways, thank y'all for watching, and have a good day. Or night. <laughs>